uh, program in political history and leadership is designed to encourage students to think about how actual decisions are made. Things are a little chaotic, to say the least. In the These are students who already have come in with a good understanding of what the Constitution is and uh, freedom and liberty, and, but also uh, practical decision making. And so we're looking to cultivate that in these students. These students come from diverse backgrounds and different opinions. So one of the things I wanted to talk about in my um, breakout session were transcendent ideas that transcend political parties or even left and right. What does it mean to make a critical decision in a critical time? How do we balance principle and compromise? When is it okay to compromise? When is it unacceptable to compromise? And these are things that students of all backgrounds and political points can uh, learn from and benefit from. The best thing about this program so far has been being able to hear great-minded people speak and be able to even discuss their thoughts in seminars and um, improve my understanding of the topics we're discussing. Oh, discussing topics like this where it's really where we use words like good and right all the time but rarely do we ever hammer down a definition that we know and what I like about these discussions is that really we iron out the details, we really find what defines these terms. As great as it is to talk about the nature of natural rights and all the things that the Founding Fathers were interested in, that's very much part of the Constitution, we wanted to focus uh, on leadership and how people are, can take these principles and put them into practice. We're partnering with a presidential institution, I believe it is the Presidential Library for Harry Truman, and they have a series of decision-making classes where you role-play decisions, which we think is a great way, uh, in a more effective way, for students to be able to get inside and feel what it's like to be a decision-maker, a leader, and then have to take those principles and put them into practice and feel the pressure and feel the reality. We've gotten feedback from students that say this is just a wonderful program. They've gotten enriched experiences out of those, not only opportunity to engage with ASU history faculty, but a chance to gain to know students from different high schools. We think that the future rests in these new leaders, our young people, that understand the importance of principle and understand the importance of practice principal pragmatism, and that's what the high school leadership academies seek to accomplish and are accomplishing. So if, if students are interested, they should uh, look at our website for the program in political history and leadership. I just encourage uh, any students interested in both politics, big ideas, but also interested in bringing those ideas into practice to, to consider applying.